Well, guys, I guess you know what time it is. It's planting time. Got. Ended up buying another planter. Same thing, but it was a cheap planter. And we're going to need to get, get this stuff in the ground soon. Because we're running in the same thing we had happen last season. Is. It's late. It's late planting. So we're going to go ahead and plant corn. And they take the case tractor down here. Well, actually, let's let's leave that there. Let's take the John Deere over. We're gonna get. Let's see if I can go around here. Since I got the GPS hooked up on this, we'll go ahead and take this over here. It's a little bit of a bump. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can get our horse play to work here. Working with, turn circles. Okay, so we got the fertilizer turned on. Let's see here, turn on field. Let's go to course generation. Let's go field. 14 current position automatic let's go yes we want two headlands and then let's go should be where is that clockwise counterclockwise at oh. hmm Should be all right. Let's get ourselves turned around here. time I've been doing this here. All right. Fingers No idea what this guy's doing. <laughs> okay, well we got GPS fixed in the one. Now we just gotta get GPS fixed in the other tractor. But we will go ahead and just let this guy struggle bus it for a while. And we are gonna go ahead and start planting corn down in the other field. I will be very interested to see what happens when we come back to that field because Whatever he's doing, he's just not doing it right. But I guess it is what it is. We'll get planted what we can get planted, and what we don't get planted, we'll just leave as is, I suppose. Go down here and.
I don't think I'll need to. Probably, I wonder if the. All right, field markers work. I'll be very interested to see how this all turns out after it gets all planted. Well, that's good that we got a the planter has uh, capabilities of direct seeding. If we end up not getting anything this season, we will probably turn the farm into just probably the shorter season stuff like wheat where temperatures aren't going to aren't going to ruin us in this in the seasons I suppose but I'm hoping we don't run into that problem but I have a very very bad feeling that we're probably gonna end up running into that problem. Alright. I just know for a fact that that guy is not done planting and it did not work. So we'll let that sit there for a minute. Um, we'll work our way up back up to the machine shed and we will take the dodge and we will skip skip that field that we're on and then we will work our way down to the next field. I think that's field 13. We're gonna work on and see if See if we can get GPS to work on that field. Maybe it's something, something with the, with the two fields, field 19 and um, field 19. What's the other one? Field 14. So see, we got some weeds coming up here. they had something that you could go around and all right we'll leave that running I wish they had something where you could go around and just spot spray fields that would be pretty nice to be able to do oh totally forgot by the way the grain bin system got installed and it's looking spectacular. So pretty excited to use it and be able to store anything and everything we need.
just as I suspected. All right. Well, we'll just skip that field. Go over this field. Okay, let's, okay, let's, course generation, field 13, generate course, wait a minute, did we mess that up? enough to it. Alright, now let's see if we can get this to work here. Field 13. There, okay, so now we got it. We will go around. Turn, corners, generate. There we go. I have a lot of faith in this. Hopefully working. So far, looking good. seems to be working all right which is good now we just got a long way to run back hey Ed, we will see see what this guy ended up doing here okay it looks like he skipped 90 percent of the field okay we'll come back we'll plant that not a problem all right so let's go back here. Yeah, go over here to our other tractor. We will continue planting. Tractor shut off. This part. Maybe it would have been better just not to. I don't know. We'll have to see what what this looks like once we get down through here.
but I definitely went ahead and slowed down time just to make sure that we're going to get all this stuff done. Oops. Went off a little bit. So definitely want to make sure that we're getting... Everything planted in a timely mash. Passion. Fashion. a pretty pretty good planter actually never uh never used this one but it seems to run pretty smoothly it's pretty responsive on the the dropping and everything so that's that's good boy this thing sounds like you're inside of an airplane This is going to be the one bad thing about this tractor. It doesn't quite... I don't think it quite has the horsepower that's needed for this planter. So, hills are going to be a little bit of an issue. But hopefully not too much of an issue. Once we get this done, then we will start working on... the... Jeez, yawning for so, so much for some reason. But once we get these headlands done, then we'll start working on our, our rows down and back. Which... Um, it's going to be a good question on what's going to be the best direction to go. I think our best bet's probably going to be... Uh, oh, well, let's just... We'll just keep going around and around and around. Cause that's going to probably look the best. And whether it's... Well, it's going to be the easiest versus trying to figure out where all the rows are and making sure all the rows are shut off. So we'll just go around in circles. And see what uh, see what ends up coming of it. Looks like our planter's doing good all over there, off in the distance. Hopefully, it just stays like that. Sometimes that's gets a little bit a uh, little bit iffy. Hope everybody's week's been off to a great start. Weather's changed up a little bit here. It's finally warmed up a hair. Still pretty cold out, but hopefully we'll be able to get some stuff done outside the next couple days. And Yeah, we'll 
we'll try to get try to get this field done over here and then we'll go double check to make sure that our other guy is planting everything the way that we need him to. Now I'm just debating on whether or not just sell these sell these fields here or sell the one field that nine nineteen and whatnot just to make it easier where right now we just need to be using GPS the best that we can with these smaller planters and where it's not really working out the best. Maybe it's best that we just don't plant in it. Because I don't... I don't know what that... GPS is going to do on that field. With that tractor and planter. I'm a little bit, a little bit afraid of how that's all going to turn out. If we end up planting it. But we may just throw weed in it for now. And just... Plant what we can with the GPS and end up just doing the stopping with that field and selling it and buying maybe just a regular size field down the road a little bit regular size field and maybe have some success there and then Eventually, once we get a bigger planter, we could go ahead and rebuy this field back. Oh, shoot. That's going to look terrible, but... That is one little itty bitty spot done. Now we'll actually probably just go ahead and head back down this way, get this field finished planting, and then we'll we'll go check and see how our other planter is doing, whether it's going haywire or if it's actually doing what it's supposed to. Definitely do like this planter though. This is I normally I normally just use like the John Deere one, but the John Deere 12 row. But this one's this one's kind of fun to use just to change it up. Fertilizer and everything, seed all works on it. So it's definitely a a positive when it comes to this planter. be able to get it all. Nope. We'll just... swing it back around and get that little piece. Alright. Now we'll head back up. Get this other little spot done.
close man. Oh yeah. Definitely definitely feeling it right here. This hopefully hopefully he makes it up the hill. I sure hope he does. spot back there. Definitely plants full speed going downhill. Hope that hope that doesn't mess with mess up the planting or population of the seed. I don't think it will, but never a good thing when when that happens a little bit. Alright, we'll go back up here, finish this little, this little strip up here. Hmm. wonder why this thing bogs down so bad. something to do. Oh. There we go. We're gonna, we're gonna have the cab open up here a little bit. We'll uh, get some air going on in here. Last little bit here. All right. up to the back up to the farm whoa forgot we got to get this a little bit planted <laughs> all right we did a little bit of land work so that's why that grass looks a little bit different in that area we kind of raised raised some stuff up a little bit just so it we could drive down this area a little bit easier. If that was real life, this would have taken a lot more seed, but it's all right. We'll leave this parked here, head over and make sure that everything's going all right with our other tractor. And then that's Jammer found a, found a squirrel or something outside. All right. Well, 
I'll be darned, look at that. He's even using his field markers. If only we weren't using a tractor that had probably 400 more horsepower than actually was needed. Probably end up a little bit better. Let's see what he's got going on here. Let's make sure that he's doing everything right. Don't want to miss anything, and if we don't want to be overplanting everything either. So far, looking good. Going up here. It seems to be... Seems to be working good. Well, that's great. Great to see GPS working in that field. But let's go ahead and let's head over to this other field here. Let's see what we got. Two fields. Over here. park there run down here and see what they got going on okay so they got barley in here I don't know if we're going to be able to you know we may have to just wait this season out or we'll we'll see if we can talk to them maybe we can make a trade this field's a lot smaller than what our fields are field 18, 19, and 17, I think it is. Um, maybe they'll be they'd be willing to make a trade on it, being so they already have that field planted. Still late, early enough in the season to get something, get something planted. So maybe they'll go for it. I don't know. We'll have to talk to him and find out whether or not that's a that would be a thing that possibility or not but we'll leave these guys running and well that guy running and we will catch everybody in the next video should be done pretty well done with planting in the next video so hopefully uh yeah hopefully we'll see everybody back here in the next video for either finishing up planting or having everything planted and started to work on fertilizing and other little side projects on the farm. Well, thanks everybody for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and we'll see you in the next one. Have a good one everybody.